Do you really want to crush your goals in 2024? What do you have planned for the Kobe year? Self-improvement, fulfillment, happiness, whatever you have planned, this is the video to check out for strategies to really put together some personal goals. My name is Rajan, I'm a content creator, and I'm here on YouTube simply documenting my journey. It's the top of the year, so let's talk about some personal goals. I'll touch on five key areas to consider when setting personal goals, and I'll share some of my personal goals. Section number one is reflecting on 2023. Before you step into your goals of the new year, you really wanna reflect on how did the previous year go for you? What did you do right? what did you do wrong like think about the things that worked and things that didn't work and how we can improve i would recommend not spending too much time here because we really want to be still present and planning for the future but the main thing here is to overall be honest with yourself section number two is to set smart personal goals smart standing for i have to read this specific measurable achievable, relevant, and time-bound. Setting clear, attainable personal goals is the key to success. It really helps you stay focused and to stay motivated. And when that motivation is done, you really have to stay disciplined. Section number three is self-care. Take care of yourself. Take care of your mental. Take care of your body. Take care of the people or take care of your space take care of yourself self-care is really something that's been a lot more talked about lately um and it's being emphasized more and i'm proud of myself and you know everybody with the awareness of that yeah you have to remember not to be so hard on yourself you have to remember to just take moments of meditation and um mindfulness for yourself section four is positive relationships i don't want to get messy here but you really need to cut out the bad energy around you and that's just straight up so whatever that means do the do the tough thing and distance yourself from those bad energy relationships those toxic people those Debbie Downers, whatever the case may be, because this year is about you achieving your goals, not compensating for people who bring you down. Section five, financial wellness. <sighs> Gotta get your money right. Gotta get your relationship with money right. Taking control of your finances in 2024 is so important. Setting a budget, saving, investing, making more money these things these are all things we could use more of we could be better at and why not use this year to lock in because it literally a year of locking in could be can change your whole life and change your whole family's lives 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 <laughs> it could legitimately change the life and trajectory trajectory of your entire family when you're financially stable that gives you some mental clarity it helps you be more creative like you're freed up to be the best version of yourself because you're not bogged down with the stresses of bills and just different things that may happen in your life so those are the five sections that i really consider when setting personal goal when i set my personal goals this year and let's share my five personal goals. Here are my goals and how I write them pretty much every day. I will lose 30 pounds by June 2024 and maintain a healthy lifestyle. I will pay down my debt by 50% by the end of the year. Um, we spent, I could elaborate on this really quick. We recently moved, we've spent a lot of money, not irresponsibly, but we have taken on some debt that we didn't previously have. And I just want to see those numbers be cut in half through dedication and focus. We have the means to do it. We just have to have the discipline to follow through throughout the year. I will build a home gym. I really love my home space 
and I want to really optimize it. And I don't always like going out to public uh, gyms. I do like, like I do like the environment sometimes, but I would really love a home gym. It would be great for me and things that I do with my wife and daughter. And ultimately, that'll be like my quote unquote man cave space because then I'll put like tools and all that stuff. I have it all planned out. I will build a home gym this year. I will invest 15% of my earnings for retirement this year. And when it comes to income, I'm raising that number. I haven't always invested 15%. I wanna raise my contributions. So that's basically what this goal is saying. I wanna raise my contribution. I want to really start pushing the envelope for earlier for early retirement than I'm currently projected. I will lead a healthy and happy family. Um, this is important to me because as a, as a black man with a wife and daughter, you just like naturally we want to just take care of everything and everybody. But what's most important, which I'm learning is important is that I need to start at home and be the best version of myself first and then have that version spew out to my wife and daughter and then the rest of my family. So I want to lead a healthy and happy family. That doesn't mean that I have to pay every bill or, you know, do everything for them. I just want my daughter to be raised in a happy and loving environment. I want my wife to continue to blossom and feel secure and supported it, support it by her husband. And I feel like I've done a good job of that in the past three years, but it's always room for improvement and I really want to level that up. Those are five of my goals. And those are five things you'll see me working on throughout this year. So if you want to follow this journey, subscribe to the channel, give the video a like, and comment what your goals is. Just comment one goal so we can talk about it. Last, you can share this video with an accountability partner. And remember, please stay patient, stay committed, stay disciplined. You do those things and you will achieve your goals. And if you don't hit them on the nose, you'll be so much closer than you were the year before that it will be motivation to just Keep it going until you get to the finish line. All right, 2024, we're going to make it a good one. Shoot, I recorded a video. I recorded a YouTube video, and I'm going to post it. So if you're seeing this, that's a win for my stuff. If you're seeing this, that's a win for me. Um, so that's it. Peace.